<laughs> yeah, mate, that's that's all the hard work done now. You know, I'm just gonna be having little sessions for the next three or four days. Maybe do Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Just um, playing about, staying sharp. A few light pads, a lot of shadow boxing. You know, I'll be doing the shadow boxing at, at home as well. I'll be, that'll, I'll be doing the shadow boxing throughout. But as far as gym work and gym time goes, all the hard work's done. I'll come down. I'll get a little sweat on tonight. A little sweat on Monday. A little sweat on Tuesday, and that's it. You know, my weight's on point. I can. Uh, I've got about a kilo and a half to lose, and I've got five days to lose it. So. It's not an issue. It's just um, now is just the mental side. You know, it's fight week. It's just about getting my head in the right place. You know, a lot of focus, a lot of visualization, a lot of meditation. You know, and I can do it as long as I can get in there and do what I know I can do. I'm going to be absolutely fine. You know, um, the decision, the outcome is out my hands. You know, all I can do is be the best version of myself turn up and give 110% in the gym like I've been doing and turn up on fight night and do what I know I can do you know and we've just got to hand the rest over to you know higher power like I say it's a bare knuckle fight anything can happen but time will tell you know I'm very focused I'm very determined um, I often think you know what, what could I have done in boxing if I had this mindset 10 years ago but you know we'll never know you know, and I, I try not to think like that all the time, but it does creep in now, the focus and the determination that I've got these days. You know, what could I have done with my life if I had this focus and determination, say in my early 20s? You know, how would things have been? How would things have worked out? You know, I, I do think about those things. I try not to dwell on them, but you know, I'm of the understanding that this has happened for a reason. This is all about time and, you know, I am on the, <laughs> the back end of my fighting age, shall we say, I'm 37, I've got a high mileage body, but, you know, I feel stronger physically and mentally than I've ever felt. I know I'm hitting harder than I've ever hit before. You know, I've got a real desire and uh, the fire's burning, you know, I've got a massive will to win. You know, and we'll see where it goes over the next 18 months. I promise my kids, I'm not gonna be anybody's punch bag. So, you know, we'll just see how this thing works out, taking it one fight at a time. But, um, you know, I'm ready and uh, I'm looking forward to putting a show on for everybody on Saturday night. I had a thing this morning, I was in that Marks and Spencer's and I'm like, tell me I want to go in, just get a sandwich, <laughs> just get a sandwich. And there was a big bit of like sticky toffee, bit of cake there, I was like, I'll just have a little bit of that as well. But my weight's on point, man, I've only got a kilo to lose. Yeah. I'd lose that. If I, and the thing, this uh, hotel's got probably things, steam room, saunas, little gym, treadmills, and all that, you know, for the lads weighing in, in case they're a little, few pound over. Yeah. I'll go put a tracksuit on and have a little run, but I don't think I will be. I think you get two hours to weigh in anyway. Yeah? Yeah. Starts at from 10 to 12. And I think there's like a, I don't know if it's like a media scrum or like the face off and all that. In the afternoon. On the Saturday? On the Friday. On Friday? On the Friday. I'd rather get out the way on the Friday anyway, you know what I mean? Then you can just chill all day on the sun, on the Saturday. Fast and sharp, eh? Yeah. Don't 
go moving, right? And do that. Fill your lungs with air. Because if you do that, the oxygen is travelling here, out your arms, back to your heart, twice as much work. Yeah. Just let it go up and down. Yeah? yeah? Down by your side. Yeah. Jump. Jump. Put me off! Put me off! Kill! Yeah, but I think you're going for a right up or up. Because right. it comes like that. Yeah. Every time you just shut shot, she dips down a bit. You show them the jab and then come through the middle. Mm -hmm. yeah. Right up through. Uh -huh. Yeah? Yeah. Hard shot the block. You won't block her because she's like that. Yeah. Because you want to take it. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Well that jab open, bang, bang, bang. And step a little bit with it, yeah, we talk. Bang, bang. Yeah. Solid, like you know what I mean? Uh -huh. Snap. Yeah. Knock his head back. Mm -hmm. If you feel that jab. Yeah? If you feel you've, you've caught a flush, as soon as you think you've caught a flush with that jab, fire the right. Because for a split second he's going to be blind. Because when you've hit him with that good jab, buff, he's going to go back and then smack. Yeah? So as soon as you feel him on that, BAM! Or, or that. Yeah. Through the middle, or that. Then there's your shots catch him. Yeah? Yeah? Set up off the jab. Yeah. Don't get don't get into a scrap early, nice and controlled, you know what I mean? Use your feet. Uh -huh. Use your feet in and out. If he's gonna rush you just step off to the side. Mm -hmm. Don't go back in straight lines. Uh -huh. Just spin off. Bam bam! We need to make two shots come there, don't we? Yeah. And they're split and wind open. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Don't need to get fives and sixes. Because uh -huh. they're not gonna land. Mm -hmm. Two good quality shots. Break his nose, bust his eyes. Yeah. That's what'll count. And but a good fucking jab. Yeah. Yeah? You'll come back to that corner after the first round. I'm not watching you, I'm watching him. Mm -hmm. I'm watching for mistakes. So whenever you come back to that corner, whatever I tell you, that's the shot he's open for. Uh -huh. You can bet your life on it. Uh -huh. yeah? yeah? And yeah, even in the fight, even in the fight, if you get a, sp a little second off him, I'll breathe on, I'll grab him, have a sly look at me, and I'll advise you, I'll uppercut, I'll, I'll backhand, I'll left hook. Uh -huh. You mean? Yeah. Just have a little sly look. Mm -hmm. Money there, you know what I meant? Yeah. Yeah? Uh -huh. And that's the shot for the catch. Yeah. Yeah. Aye. Fucking rare to go on. Do a good early night. Aye. Fuck him up, mate. That's what I'm looking catch for. Catch him good shot. <laughs> set him up with that jab. Mm -hmm. You don't need to get fucking weird in. Uh -huh. Just set him up nice and controlled. Use your feet. Bang, 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 bang. Uh -huh. Let him sit right and end the shots. Yeah. Lunge back because you're going to use his body weight. Uh -huh. He's going to come. You've seen him fight. Uh -huh. Yeah? Yeah. You need to meet him. Just lunge back. Use his body weight. He's coming. Boom, <laughs> boom. Twice the collision. Uh-huh. Still catch him. Yeah. Wanna be sat in that fucking crowd. Huh? Wanna be sat in that crowd watching the last two fights. That's it. Mm -hmm. Out early night. Yeah. Don't get paid for all the time in there. That's it. Get him fucking out of the teeth and join your night. You set him up off that jam. Yeah. Don't neglect it. Mm -hmm. Don't be flat with it as well. Be on the balls of your feet, yeah. Nice, nice, nice and controlled. Not not, not like that. Not not reaching for it. Uh -huh. Not wanting to get word in. Right hand there. Rub it on your cheeks so you know it's there, and up on them toes, yeah? Bam, bam! Bam, bam! Nice, smart, snappy, yeah? Just move, move, just, just on there. Let him come, step there. Bam, bam! Bam, 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 bam! Nice and, nice and fast. Cut them to pieces. I'm going to give him a bite. Eh? I'm going to fucking give him a bite. Guaranteed? I'm going to give him a bite. Switched on from the word go. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm sick of losing the first round.
Raiders on this BKFC UK card in Newcastle. They recorded a victory on BKFC's UK debut at Wembley Arena in London. That was in August. David Brown and still the upcoming Mick Terrell in our main event and a fast start for Danny Christie as he drops Darren Godfrey with the left hand. It's heavy forward pressure from Christie. Big left hand knockdown number two. We'll see how hard Christie goes now for the finish. Christie needs to jump all over the finish right now. There's the answer, left hand, right hand, and I think we might be done. You can just tell every time Christie lands a clean shot, Godfrey's going down. We are done. Alan Jackson breaks off his count. Game, set, match. Danny Christie. One-way traffic for Danny Christie. Now 2-0 and oh in Bare Knuckle Fighting Championship. Danny Christie!